Hey guys, Jim Boyabin here, and today we're back with another episode of Elgarian Skies. Today is episode 2, and today what I have planned for you guys is a lot of pretty sick things. As you can see, guys, I'm just showing you what I did in between episodes. It's been pretty cool. I uh, did a little bit of work here and there. got uh, some melons and stuff like that, which is pretty cool. So now I actually have a stable source of food, and we're actually getting a ton of melons, which I really like. So that's going to be pretty good, of course, for... Uh, the future in this series. Um, so well, today what I thought of doing guys is we're going to be actually mining this really really, really big tree. I thought of doing it because uh, we really do need to do an episode because I believe it's been almost less than a week I believe since I actually uploaded uh, a Lugarian Skies video so I thought it would be uh, just smart to just upload one now of course for you guys and stuff like that. Uh, like bear with me guys the first few episodes are going to be a little bit Probably a little bit boring, I'm sorry. They're just like that. It's just how the game works. Of course, the first few episodes of a lot of games are a little bit boring. Uh, because, of course, it's really hard to actually do some stuff. But, of course, uh, in the future to come, when we do have like a lot of resources and stuff like that, of course, everything's going to be relatively easy to get. So, we're just going to easily take down this... Uh, sorry, easily... Uh, just do a lot of quests and stuff like that in this game. So right now, guys, like I said before, I'm just doing a little bit of work around here. Uh, pretty much taking apart this, uh, like taking apart this base, uh, sorry, this tree right over here. Because I need it to pretty much, I need the wood to do a little bit of work on pretty much this place right over here. That I'm going to be working on for pretty much a really, really big tree farm that I want to work on. So that I can constantly get a lot of wood really, really fast. I thought that would be a really smart idea. So, uh, we got... This this tree is probably pretty gigantic, actually. I'm surprised that I got it. I thought this would be, like, the one tree that would actually do it, like, for episode two. Because I thought that would be a smart idea. Like, a really, really big tree, of course, in modded, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's good as I did put a piece of, uh, what's it called, wood there. So I'm not, like, being cautious about items falling off the ledge and everything like that so i think we have really no more wood to get so let's just use this crook and hopefully you can get a few silkworms also while we're doing this uh might as well uh so we're i don't even know how much uh saplings we have right now we we have six in our inventory uh inventory i mean and it looks like there are just tons of pretty much saplings on the ground and everything and of course like a ton of wood so that's gonna be pretty cool uh let's just go ahead and get that wood over there and it looks like another melon uh melon already grew which is pretty awesome so now we have a ton more melon ton of more melons which is really cool so let me just eat these really quickly um now we can just eat those i'll just eat this apple why not uh because we don't really use the apple for anything uh but the saplings are just dropping really really fast which is good uh, so we're already at 18 saplings, so I'm going to go ahead and actually make a few things. So first of all, guys, I want to make a, uh, I'm going to go ahead and make a few things. I'm going to first turn this on to wood, and what I want to do is make another, uh, pretty much another oak barrel so that we can just, I don't know, like, speed up the, like, so we can do more, we can pretty much turn more saplings into dirt. Uh, so there we go, perfect. And now we'll just come down here and collect the rest of the saplings that should be here. Yep, there are. There's a ton of them. There's two, which is good. And now we have all this wood, so we can go ahead and go over here and actually work on this part over here. So what I do, guys, is I'm actually be uh, pretty much making this into like, as I said before, pretty much a giant tree farm in a way, because I need more area than this that one tree over there. Because I find that not the, not like the best thing possible. This is like one spot. It's really bad in terms of pretty much what I'm getting out of that um, what out of this area. How pretty much the efficiency is pretty low. So, oh, we didn't get a big tree. If we did get a big tree, that would actually be pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna get out some really quickly. I'm gonna get out actually a few. Uh, sorry, we're going to make a few, pretty much a few things right now. So let's go ahead and make, sorry, a few, uh, what's it called? Um, pretty much a few crooks and everything like that because I do need a few of those. Just get down these trees and pretty much get some more silkworms because I'm planning on making uh, pretty much that farm over there is also going to be a silkworm. Sorry, also going to be a string farm at the exact same time because I'm going to add silkworms onto the trees sometimes. And then pretty much I'm going to be getting uh, like wood and I'm going to be getting string at the exact same time. And also silkworms at the exact same time if I do use, um, of course, crooks and everything like that. 
Uh, let's just get rid of that and put this here because I definitely want to mine with this more because it can actually upgrade, which is pretty cool. Uh, so, uh, look at all these saplings. Oh my god, there's so many saplings. Uh, just looking around to uh, get all the saplings. Oh my god, are they despawning? Don't despawn. Don't, we don't want you to despawn saplings. Don't despawn on us. Uh, so these should have some wood awesome and I'll just do this again so I've been doing this for actually a while now and I pretty much got a little bit of dirt from that but of course it hasn't been good because I oh come on where's the saplings are they just falling down yeah it looks like they're just falling down and going back up because they're on that right over there uh, I'll just check in there I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed really quickly guys just so we can make it daytime because I really don't want to fight a creeper or anything like that right now uh so, uh, just come down over here and grab, oh, that tr saplings would just fall over right there. Okay, uh, so we're already at two dirt, which is good, so I'm going to go ahead and pretty much go here, which is about three over, and place down one piece of dirt. So it's two from each, uh, so we'll do that again, so it's two from each, so it's right over here. And we'll pretty much do that a few times and place down our saplings over there. Uh, this should be a sapling. Awesome. Now we can do that again and place it here. So pretty much it's going to be on a corner in a way. And then what we'll be doing is also doing a little bit of building on the side here. One more over because I do want to, um, I want to pretty much remove this right over here. And then I want to remove this. And then what I'm going to do is after that, I'm going to add in right over here a uh, few, uh, pretty much a few uh, what's it called? Stairs and everything like that. Oh, I already have some. I never even knew that for a second. Uh, so we'll just add that there. And then, uh, let's just go ahead and add that. And we'll add that over here. So perfect. And now we'll just dig this and this. So we'll just make a normal straight pathway. I kind of want to make it look a little bit cool. But then again, it kind of doesn't look that good. So I'm just going back to this way and just removing all this stuff on the side over here. Uh, so now we can just simply do this. And then what I'll do is I'll get out my, oh no, I was going to catch that so I could put that up there. I'll just put a normal piece of wood, I guess, there. And then we'll dig this over here um, so that if I got that right, yes, it's over there. So we can go ahead and dig this and pretty much place a piece of wood there because then it's identical because I do want to make stuff good. But of course, guys, I also want to maximize efficiency while I'm at it. So let's just go ahead and do that. So now we have a little neat pathway and everything like that. Uh, and now what I do is to this pathway, I want to kind of edit it a little bit to make it look a little bit better. Uh, so it's like this right over here. And then it's going to look something like that on this side. So I'll try to do that. Uh, a little bit tricky, however. Uh, do we have? Yes, we have some green blocks. So I'm going to go ahead and dig this. And we're going to go ahead and place that green block there just to help it out. So it looks a little bit nice. Um, and then what we'll do is dig this. And we'll dig that too. So then we'll take that, dig that. So I believe that's identical except for, of course, this part up here. And then, yeah, so now we have it identical. So it looks a little bit better. And then, of course, what we do have to do is get rid of this. Get rid of that and place that so now it looks exactly identical. I'll probably take out this a little bit later, maybe. I really don't know, but I kind of do like that, so I'll probably leave it for now. Uh, I'm just looking at what we could do right over here. Uh, it's just a little bit. Oh my god, why did I place that there? Okay, um, so we'll go ahead and take this stuff right over here. I don't even know if we can, we have to like, we have to put some stuff away in our chest. I'll put about three crooks in there. That sounds perfect. So now we're at uh, two dirt again, which is good. So I'll just go over here and do the exact same thing. So we're three. So one, two, three. So right over here. And then because it is exactly three over, I have to place another row right over here because I want to make it the exact same on two sides. And then what I'll probably do, guys, is also I'll have like the corners with trees, and then the, uh, probably inside I'll think of that by next episode, of course. But I'm still puzzling and thinking what I want to do. I have to eat some melons. Almost forgot about that. I'm, I also want to, guys. I also want to do, guys. Let I, oh my God! What I also want to do is kind of like work on getting a better f food resource because melons are they're a good food resource, but of course, guys. 
they do um, pretty much they do take a long time to go over there as you guys can see I don't even know how long it's been but pretty much we haven't even I don't even think I believe like one melon grew in all that time so it does take a long time of course to grow melons and pretty much what I had to do to get all these melons is pretty much sit here without moving and then pretty much just wait a long time and then it took me a long time to get all these melons but yeah so that that was pretty cool so let's go ahead and we're gonna grow probably a few more trees and definitely work on that uh but let's go ahead and just take down this tree right over here and then i'm just gonna check can i repair this uh we'll repair that and then we'll repair that twice there we go perfect uh and then what i'll do is i'll just use this crook so i can just ease easily take down this uh pretty much this i don't know just i'll just take the pretty much take down the rest of the tree and everything like that um Let's just go ahead and do this, so we can just take that down, and then we should be done right over there. Uh, let's just go around here. Okay, so we're at six right here, so we'll just leave that over there, and then we'll plant one more over here, and then one more over here. And then what I'll probably do is do another three over here and place another one here, do like... Probably something with a long row over there of just trees, so I can easily take that down. Of course, in the future, I would definitely want to make that automated, but for now, we we have to mine it down ourselves and everything like that. Um, but yeah, I think that is almost going to be it for this episode, guys. It's been, I think it's been about 12 minutes now, so probably going to do a few more things, guys, and then I'm going to definitely have to do some more work on this place. Probably next episode, guys, what I'm anticipating anticipating is that we'll probably have this whole layer done right here a little bit more expansion I'll probably be actually doing pretty much a ring around this in a way because that's what I kinda wanna do and also what I wanna do is pretty much uh, dig this out here to have more melons and what I also wanna do guys is plant these seeds over here I planted I think I planted a few of them uh, before but um, yeah I believe I planted a few of them before just for some food and stuff like that uh, but that did take a while, so I'll try to maybe get a farm, guys, but of course we will need iron so that we can actually use that infinite water source over there. I don't really know how water exactly works in this game, so I'm going to definitely have to figure that out. Um, but yeah, so we'll go ahead and just take down this one tree over here with the rest of our saplings that we have right now, because I want to get, uh, uh, sorry, the rest of our bone meal. I want to get at least, like, one stack that I can keep for a while. I'll probably save up and use it for definitely repairing uh, pretty much my tools. Um, I'll probably just save this from repairing my tools. And definitely in a few episodes to come, guys, you will be seeing a mob farm. And, of course, just other stuff so we can actually get bones and stuff like that. Uh, and probably mar mob farm is going to be really go good because this is similar to Skyblocks, uh, which is pretty cool. And I may actually be starting my own Skyblock series, which would be pretty cool, guys. Make sure to check that out on my channel uh, when it does come out, uh, of course. Uh, but, yeah, I'll just plant this over here. And, oh, we already have one tree that grew over here, which is good. Uh, but, of course, this is just a little bit tricky, guys, because uh, we do have pretty much, like, over here, it's not, like, if saplings do fall down, some of them could actually fall off, which is definitely a problem, so I'm just going to, I'm probably going to do, yeah, ex expanding on each of the corners also, other, and, um, uh, and pretty much, as I said before, adding, uh, the layers, adding more layers over here and stuff like that, so you will see a lot of cool stuff in the next episode, guys, so make sure to check that out when it does come out, uh, but yeah, that's going to be pretty much it for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, a like would, of course, be really appreciated. And if you really enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you really enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to apply to the Jim Wilton Craft Network for a 70% revenue share. But that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. This has been Jimbo Evan, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.